Constituency, Lagos State. I stand before you this afternoon, Mr. Speaker, to contribute to the issue on ground. There are many two ways into this. Simply because we are talking of court ruling, we are not talking of protesting. Protest in democracy is acceptable and is allowed. But it does not translate to maiming and killing people, killing innocent people. We have to fight the two. If the executive harm has failed in its responsibility in ensuring that the issue of corruption has not been obeyed, let us find out before we can criticize. If the other group has not done what they should have done under the law, we should also criticize them too. Protest does not translate to arm twisting. Protest does not translate to killing people. Protest does not translate to maiming people. Look at the number of people that have died. DCP has died. Umar is a Muslim. Hi, I'm talking, I am a Muslim. The president is a Muslim. The chief dusty is a Muslim. Azak Zaki is a Muslim. Thank God this is not a case of Christian versus Muslim. This is not a case of Yoruba versus Ausa. This is not a case of Fulani versus Doma. This is a case of Muslim to Muslim. Institution against individual. Institution against group and organization. If the government has not obeyed, if the government has not done what we should have done, that does not mean we should take arms and continue to kill people, even though protest is part of democracy. But it does not mean we should engage in arm twisting technique. It does not mean we should engage in cowboy tactics. This is too much. A, a person who is serving in the channel television has been shot. We are praying for his life to, so that he, he, will not, he will not die. How about those that have died? We have to think before we know what we are talking about, simply because we are here to moderate. We are not here to judge. We are here to listen to the two and take position. Let us sit down with stakeholders and resolve amicably. That is the way out. Thank you, Mr. Speaker.